Hi, I'm not yet dead in name and in nature, and welcome back to Train Sim World. So yeah, we're going to do um, a little bit more on the Great Western Express, um, but today we're not going to do the Express. I thought we'd try a little freight. So there's a freight train uh runs on the uh, Great Western Line. Um, and the uh, scenario is called Aggregate Industries. So it's the Class 166. It's quite an iconic locomotive in the UK uh, for doing um, uh, freight, very long freight trains. I see a few of them around. So this says, discharge a rig of hoppers at Hayes Tarmac Facility before working the train to Acton Yard, preparing it for the return journey. So, Aggregate Industries. Slow speed control, so speed to on. So we have to unload these wagons through us reverse, okay. Speed set the speed to three. Oh, cool. Two, three. Yeah. There we go. Start the slow speed control using F1 on the EM2000. Release the automatic brakes. There's a train. Right, so I think we set it so that some sort of maximum speed makes sense to go external, I think, to see what we're doing. Oh, wow, cool. Wow, 618 yards at three and a bit miles an hour. This is going to take a little time. How many carriages we got? Carriages. Wagons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, cool. Bit of a, bit of a murky day. So where are we going? Going to unload them. Uh -huh, this is cool. Tarmac facility. Okay. Down to 500 yards. Yeah, this might take a little while. I suppose it could do this. Still gonna take a little while. I'll um, I'll see you when we start unloading. I think. Right. So we've started unloading. I've just um, I've set us up in free camera mode. I've just parked us, as you can see. So some of the some of the carriages, some of the keep saying carriages, some of the trucks are empty already. They've gone through there at 0%. Just um, 
trying to balance speed a little bit if you put them through at the speed it's set at it's just too fast uh, to get fully unloaded but um, you can see it's dropping nicely and you can actually even see the aggregate dropping through each section of the, the truck that's quite cool actually I like that uh, train's just coasting at the moment that one emptied nicely I don't think you win I'm assuming providing each one gets to green will probably be alright anyway so I don't think you have to empty each one completely but it's nice too like to be thorough Nicely done. So we're just over fifty percent of what it needs. It's looking pretty good actually. It's slowing down a little bit, but it's coasting nicely, and it's a good speed for the carriages to empty. This is um, this is quite good. Lights, can you see the stuff passing through? I'm assuming not. That'd be a little bit much. No, but I bet you can see it unloading well from in here. Does it in block from them? Actually, it's pretty, it's pretty effective. Oh, I managed to get this camera stuck. That's okay. I'll just do this. I can see it in a minute. Hmm. There you go. Ooh, there's a high speed train. I see a bit of activity on the line. Right, nearly there. Last one. Okay, so I'm going back to driver mode. Let's stop the train when we need to. Last truck, last section, there it goes, done, plug brakes, turn the slow speed controller to off, okay. Reversed forward. Apply power using the throttle. Crank up a little. What's the line speed? 15. Okay. It's alright for a sec. Here we go. Stop at location Hayes Goods Loop. Pretty that's sort of what gets us back onto the main line. So we're at 11, 12, 13, 14. Just throttle back a little bit. 15, right. We're about to hit a 25 mile an hour line speed anyway. Wait for it to take effect before we uh, carry on. Next signal's green. Oh, but then we're stopping in 100 yards anyway, so that's fine. Right, so throttle at zero. A little bit of brake. takes a while to stop. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hopefully I won't mind too much that I've overshot by quite a number of yards. I can always go back if I need to. A 
least there's no red signals about. Good. Phew, that's a relief. Wait for a moment. Put the brakes to hold. Okay. Oh, 5.7 miles. All right. Let's get going then. So we got. She's still got a line speed of 15. Despite the fact we just went through a sign saying 25. Never mind. That's okay. But it now says we've got another sign that says line speed 15 in 80 yards. 70 yards. So it went up to 25, went up to 15. Sorry, it was at 15, went up to 25, now it's going back to 15. Oh right, 85 and 100. Okay, fine. So we can crank it up in a sec. I think I saw, yep, max speed 75, so line speed 85, max speed of the train is 75. I'm just not setting the cab yet, let's not go crazy. Sounds at the edge of the road, say 852, at the edge of the road, at the edge of the track. <laughs> oh well, here you go. Huh. Um, hmm. Ah, it's gone now. Right. 85 it is. Five miles to go. I was clearly having far too much fun messing me out with camera angles and everything else and we've blown a couple of speed limits but not madly so I've got full brake on throttles at zero we're just gradually slowing down probably gonna miss that 15 mile an hour one as well I'm hoping we'll stop in time for our stop point at 500 yards you might not hmm. Hopefully we'll stop for the red light at 900 yards, otherwise we've got a problem. Red light, red signal. Yeah, we're well over that 15 mile an hour. Line speed. Actually... Also we've taken the momentum out of the train, so the train's starting to slow down a bit more effectively now. 19, 18... 17... Well, we'll be all right for the red red signal, which is the main thing. Because you don't want to go through a red signal. That's a problem. But actually, that's not bad. We're going to overrun it, but only just. Not much. Trying to line it up nicely with this train next to us. I'm going to miss that too. 
but again, not by a lot. Hopefully we'll be within limits. Otherwise I'll just need to back up a little bit. That's okay. Nice. Refuel? Oh, cool. Right, what do we do? Detach the wagons. Oh, right. Detach the wagons. That's what we do. Okie dokie. Can't get out. Hey, the train started moving. Why is the train moving? Throttles at zero. Brakes on. Oh, note to self. Okay. Don't put the uh, don't put the brake to release when you're sitting on a slope. <laughs> I thought oh, it's fine. We stopped. I'll put the brake now. No, put the brake on hold. Okay. Manual coupling flipped uncouple. Cool. Stop at location, shunt siding. Uh, okay, time to use the map, I feel. So we're blue. I guess clearly our line is blue. So, okay. Actually, it's pretty direct, isn't it? So there shouldn't be. Release the brake. Total up. Take it steady because we're still on that incline. Okay. Down to zero. Hmm, might need a little bit of throttle. Slow down a little bit too much. And again, throttle down to zero. Let's see if we can just coast in a little bit. Hopefully, got enough. yards, 40 yards, no, not enough, throttle up a little bit, break, perfect, nice, so we stopped at the shunt siding, It seems to like the fact that we've stopped the shunt siding. So we'll just edge it forward a touch. There we go. Three and seven six yards. Stop at location at and yard refueling. Oh, I did find. Oh no, sorry, internal cameras. More. Put your head out. Okay. Now blue line, I'm assuming that means that the points are set. Oh, hang on. So the arrows... So it looks to me like... 
I might need to set some points. So basically we need to get to here. Hang on, can I do this? Switch lever. Oh, I can. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so that looks like that should be right. me to go through so let's try it so obviously need to set the river set the reverse to reverse so i need to stick my head back in no there we go right i should not have to i could do it shortcuts but you know it's fine it's fun so go into reverse release the brakes a little bit of throttle because you're going uphill so it might take a little bit actually no not too bad is quite fun moving around in the yard a bit something and refueling that's what I thought I'd have a go this one I thought well, it might be a bit different to just you know taking trains up and down but of course we did a little bit of this in the last one not quite the same but we had to take it into a yard and change train ends um, and I'm assuming actually I wonder in this instance we might put the uh, the loco back at the Oh, me. Put the loco back at the front of the, the you know, at the front, the other end of the, 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 the train carriages. Right, so that's obviously where we need to get to. I assume we're coming up on our points. Can I see the... Oh, cool. That's where we are. Oh, I can't even mess this up. Oh, no, don't do that. Here comes the train. Fingers crossed we'll move over what two tracks? Three tracks. Are we gonna go the right way? Yes, we are. Okay, so they've moved into two, so there's only two to cross. Actually it goes into one. Which must mean Need to get past this lever here, right underneath me. Then to go back a little bit. Break. We did that a little bit. So actually, what we could do, I believe. I'm sure I've seen this somewhere. Yeah, so that one's currently set to take me back up to the main line. So we'll change that. That's good. Right, so now... Yep, that one's fine. Oh, I see. So you highlight it and... Yep, yeah, okay. But that one's not right. Cool. Should be it. As far as I can tell. Change the reverse up. No. Okay. Release the brakes.
seems to take quite a lot of power to get going on here, not sure why. But okay, we're going. Yep, so that point's definitely set right. You can see you can see on the track where they're positioned, so where the tracks are positioned. Same with the next one, looking good. Slowing down a little bit. Don't need to right now. Same time, I don't want to go too fast, but. That one's set OK. Probably want it a bit early to throttle down to what? To two, isn't it? Uh, to zero, rather. And yep, yeah, clearly so, because we're slowing down. Let's throttle it back up to three. Down a little bit of momentum. Back down to two. Back down to one. It's still quite tricky to balance the... Yeah, we are going downhill. To balance the speed, it seems to need three, at, three on the throttle to be going at all. Okay, objective complete. Remove the fuel cap. <laughs> Looks like it's on this side of the train, so I might as well get out this door. I thought it too. Connect the fuel hose and fuel nozzle pick up. Oh, genius. Oh no. Keep the fuel cup off. Ah, there we go. Okay. Slightly weirdly, it's the pump's already jig the pipe is already jigging about despite the fact that I don't know the valve yet, but I've opened the valve. Filling up nicely. To maximum capacity. Let's hope it's an auto off. Oh, it is. Oh, phew. I say, how am I, guess, how am I supposed to know? Put that back. Uh, okay. Fuel cap. Closed. Okay. Get it hooked back up to the wagons. Alrighty. Oh, so we need to go back 758 yards to track M. Wowzers, that's a lot of points. Apparently that's track M. Not sure how you're supposed to know that, it's not marked. But anyway, um, so that one's fine. That one's fine. That one's fine. That one's fine. They all look okay. Oh, come on. Yep. Yep, they're all fine. Okay. So, reverse to reverse. Bottle up. Breaks off. Hope 
فلاقي yards to go so gone through one two okay looking good so should be crossing over the next line so that one there it's quite fun to follow on here yards still on target yeah the yards and so on perfect uh, objective complete Stop at Acton Yard R1. Um, okay. So the first thing you need to do is get back in the cab. You need to set the reverser to forward. There's an awful lot more to think about on this one. Awful lot to think about. Right, so, again, points look okay. Actually, yeah, there's only one really, and it looks, and it, it's automatically set. It's not one I can adjust manually, so we're all good. Come back out, it's going to take a bit of oomph, oomph to get us going. Better take it steady. Yep, brakes are off. Okay. Right, back down to two down to one. 200 yards, 100 yards. One more line over. There we go. Perfect. A little bit of throttle. Formation, okay. Release the brakes. Yeah, a little bit of throttle. 100 yards. I need to do this quite carefully.
Can I try this? I could regret this. Let's see if I can do this. Okay, so I'll we'll set that up. Throttle one. Bringing it forward. Here she comes. I've no idea how accurate you need to be. <laughs> what I don't want to do is bump into them. Right. Um, okay, so steady it off. A bit of brake. Release the brake. Oh, too much brake. Okay, throttle one. I'm hoping that's about right. Oh, this thingy that you get is a bit annoying. The um, sort of cursor. Forgetting I've got it right. Fingers crossed. Uh, okay. I mean, I'm slap bang on. Do I need to go the other side with it? Sorry for the silence, I'm focusing. Just waiting for that speedo to move one notch. We're gonna get enough on throttle one, or do we need throttle two? Surely we're too far away now, right? Yeah, kinda. slightly weird it's just edging forwards but not showing me any speed at all which I find slightly odd whatever it's doing what it's doing is no big deal because actually it'll allow it'll make it a lot easier for me to stop it right it's kind of weird it's doing that I wonder if it's supposed to do that gotta say I wouldn't have thought so but
Oh, well, that's interesting. Probably best if I stop the carriages there. Well, there you go. Isn't there a parking brake somewhere? Can I apply the parking brake? Set the reverser to neutral. Make sure that that's off. Make sure that's applied. Cool. Done. Oh, I left all the doors open, didn't I? Because I was creeping about. Okay, shut that one. Shut that one. Shut that one. Shut that one. Oh, head over to the Porter Cabins, Corporate Cabins for a cup of tea. Lovely. Well, that's kind of weird you could do that with when you're physically still in the cab and you're just using the camera, but I'm glad you could because otherwise that would have been quite tricky. A bit of in and out, in and out. Glad I figured that out actually. Nice. Oh, that was fun. That was a little bit different. Got the uh, unloading facility thing. So that's each of the carriages that you unloaded. That's slightly weird. Nice. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed this video. Sorry, I should have been saying that as I was walking along. Um, yeah, that was fun. It was a bit different. So. We've nearly finished actually the Great Western scenario, so um, yeah, perhaps we should do a, a US one next, and then we'll we'll mix around a bit and move around because there's also freight stuff on the US. So um, yeah, I, I hope you've enjoyed this. If you did, um, please give us a like. If you haven't subscribed yet and you'd like to, uh, please do. I say there'll be more of this coming, um, and actually looking forward to uh, a new line coming out for Trainson World as well. And uh, yeah, I look forward to welcoming you back. Uh, to train some world very soon. Bye bye for now.